Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm welcoming you back, or hello, new visitors. Uh, I'm China Ray Steen and welcome to my channel. I hope that you find this information encouraging and helpful and awesome. Okay, so let's get started. So uh, this is episode two of my um, student loan debt repayment vlogging series, okay? So episode one, you guys found out how much debt that I was in, because it has decreased since then. I was in, let's look at that, $41,898.93. And after paying uh, our first payment in over a year and a half, we paid $1,200 on it last week. And now it is down $1,200 which makes it $40,698.93. Yeah! <laughs> I can change my voice, something crazy. I don't know if you guys noticed that yet. And the goal is to pay it all off by or by or in July. So it might be the beginning, it might be the end. God willing, it'll be June, May. Name it, claim it, okay. <laughs> Anyways. Um, July sometime in July so that's when we plan on paying it off so a little it's like 10 months basically what um, we plan on paying off this student loan debt so we got started before the extension was up uh, because in that email it was so funny it made you feel like your parent is talking to you and they're like we're cutting you off we're not helping you you know no more okay that's basically the vibe i got from that email it's like this is the last time children okay, so welcome to episode two um basically uh, i wanted to come on here real quick to encourage you guys and encourage myself and to make this next payment so uh, basically, when you're starting anything, it could be a job, it, you name it. When you're starting anything in the beginning, you know, your goal, when you're starting working towards your goal, you're so excited, right? But eventually that, you know, high dies down a little bit and you realize, oh, I actually have to do stuff I don't really want to do. And in this case, it could be like, you know, we are huge foodies, me and my husband, we will pay for some good food, okay? That's why I shop at Whole Foods all the time. Somebody pray for me. Um, okay, so we like to, you know, last week we had a date day and we planned on going to a vegan place that wasn't gonna cost as much, but they closed early, so guess what? We went to a non-vegan place and we balled out, okay? <laughs> Anyways, I don't know, whatever you consider ball out, but I had to do the budget today and uh, let's just say that uh, there was some extra spending, but we had a good time. The goal was to kind of, you know, put as much as we can on this month. It's like, oh great, 2000, that was the goal. Let me, let me be straightforward, okay? So last week we paid 1200, this week I thought, you know, we'll be doing like 1200,000, you know. And once I did the budget and I'm like, oh, we're not doing eight, oh, we're not doing 12, oh, we're not doing one. I almost despised what we were gonna be able to do for a quick second, but my perspective is, is great but it's like okay when you go from paying 1200 to what we're about to pay 400 it makes it feel so insignificant so i was reminded of the scripture do not despise small beginnings don't despise small beginnings so usually when you're starting out you're not gonna start off you know up there you you know you're gonna start that's why they say start from the bottom right and you're gonna work your way up and, and, and if you're too busy despising, you know, what you have to work with or your resources, then you won't really be able to appreciate it like you should. And if you're not having an attitude of gratitude, you're not thankful, you're not being a good steward, you know, over what you're entrusted, you're going to blow it. I could have said, hey, this 400 is nothing. It's not worth recording over. It's not worth paying the government. I should just spend this money somewhere else because it's not even significant. I shouldn't even make a video on this. But you know what? That is a lie and the devil is a lie because that $400 is a step. It's small, but it is going to put us, uh, you know, it is going to decrease our, my debt. Okay, let me stop trying to be deep. It's gonna decrease the debt. The debt is gonna go down by $400. 
I need to be consistent. Consistency is so important when you're starting anything out because it's easy to start, but it's harder to finish, right? And now everybody's gonna be, you know, cheering you on. Not everybody even cares, but you care. And you know that there are people out there that you can help with what you're doing, right? So you stay the course because it's important. It's important, right? So in order for us to stay the course, I'm gonna read another scripture to encourage you and to encourage me. And we all should know it. But I'm actually gonna start off a little bit before it. So why am I in the book of Acts? I should be in Philippians chapter four, verses 10, I think, because I looked it up before this. But it basically says, I could do all things through Christ who gives me the strength. And it basically says that, you know, Paul, he's saying, I've learned to be content when I got, when I got it and when I, when I'm hungry and when I'm stuffed. In any situation, I can do all things to Christ who gave me strength. Guys, and I'm going to go in and make this $400 payment because I'm grateful that we even have the $400 to make the payment on. I'm going to be, I'm going to rejoice and be glad in it. And uh, see you guys in a second. All right, and we're back. All right, like I said, it is down to $40,698.93. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't know which voice I want to do. I have too many choices. Okay, let's uh, let's not act brand new. Um, the last payment was twelve hundred. Uh, that was on nine seventeen. Okay, so I would like to target specific wounds. We don't just want to do it all willy nilly. All right. Um, so this one is the smallest one currently for now, uh, $992.78. So, um, we're going to knock this down by 400 bucks. We're going to say today because we don't want to, you know, we just want to get it out the way. Pick the account and make zip it all right we're fine and submitting and the four hundred dollar payment has been made progress has been made debt is being decreased confirmation was just received and it feels good okay y'all so now i'm just about to fill this out just like last time put all that necessary information right on in there and then episode two will be in the books. Episode two in the books. Episode two in the books. What's today, y'all? Mmm. Today is a tw mm, 27th? 28th? Think about it. Think about it. Uh, 400. Now we owe 40,000. $298.93. Boom. Uh, today is the 27th, I think, right? Let me double check. Today is the 27th. Alrighty. Alright, y'all. So we filled it out. Student loan debt, 927 $400 off the TIZOP. Uh, now that's what we're down to. That's my signature. What am I doing? I didn't get that much sleep today, guys. So thank you for bearing with me. Thank you for watching episode two. Uh, thank you for listening to my rants and the word. And uh, thank you for your time. Like always, y'all. Can, you, can you get the top of my head? Like always, you guys. It's been a pleasure. Thank you so much. Uh, feel free. No, don't feel free. Please do. Like share and subscribe until next time guys